What's up guys? So we are uh, down here at the shop um, trying to get a little bit of leeway on the truck again. Um, it's Saturday. It's not, you know, don't have a whole lot of time, but this is how far that we got the other day. I have actually just put my fuel sending unit together the other night. Um, but right now we need to focus on this exhaust. What I'm going to do is both of these, uh, this manifold on this side, it has that doghouse little flange on the back and so does this trick manifold. And I just really like V-bands better. So uh, my buddy Taylor's gonna help me do that. And our wastegate, down here at the bottom, it shoots directly into our inner fender. And I'm just not a huge fan. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn that up a little bit, see if I can kind of avoid cutting the inner fender out for that. And um, just a lot of, I can't weld. So that's a, that's a weak point for me. Um, but what I can do is I can take it to Taylor. We can kind of mock it up, get everything fitting. And um, that's just how we'll have to get it to work. We're going to have to pick that up a lot. And uh, it's just kind of part of it. So um, this turbo stuff is not, you know, the easiest as far as it goes. You know, unless you buy a kit or, you know, you buy something that specifically came off of one that somebody's already put the work into. Um, I'm just kind of throwing this stuff together, trying to make it work. So, um, you know, that makes it tough, but well worth it. So I'm going to... Uh, yank all this stuff off real quick we're gonna take a visit out to uh out to taylor's shop and uh, hopefully he's got a little bit of time on him and uh we're gonna cut this stuff off and get it welded back on so let's uh let's yank it off let's get out there to taylor's all right so we are out here at taylor's i will show you guys what that i mean by this uh doghouse flange on the end of this thing and uh we're gonna cut it off and we're gonna make it work so uh start rocking and rolling all right so this right here is our dog box house looking thing. I do not like it. So I got some beat bands. We're gonna take a band saw, yank that off of there, and uh, we're gonna beat band it. Alright, so I use the band saw and cut the little dog house off of it. And if I do say so myself, it looks pretty good. So uh, Taylor's gonna take our beat band here. He's gonna weld it right on there like so. And it'll be ready to rock for the driver's side. Then we got the hard manifold over there on the floor, so uh, we'll mess with it here in a second. Yeah. All right, so we got this manifold right here. The big band and everything is on, ready to rock. Now we're gonna go over here to our trick manifold. And this is how that it comes out of the box is just with a little doghouse ear on it and so um and funny story is this is actually a blend he puts a little mark in it as a little slag in it what i'm going to do is i'm going to cut this off and we're going to b-band this one band back off we misplaced it by accident uh, we thought that we could kind of avoid everything and go down but it actually put it right into our inner fender so we're gonna cut this off because we still need this v-band and uh, we're gonna take and cut it right here and just bend us a pipe up get it kind of beside the turbo and off the inner fender and we'll uh, we'll just make it work so let's rock and roll All 
Alright, so we had to mount our turbo. We got all that cut off right there. And check out that little pipe. It's going to be a good, smooth flow all the way to the wastegate. The wastegate is going to come up right here, set a little bit, you know, just like right in this area. So it'll be good and out of the way of everything. And uh, I think we're good. We'll pull the turbo off, weld that on, and we're ready to rock. So we've got the turbo mounted, the wastegate is on. We've got enough room right there for a blanket. Everything's out of the way for the drain. Everything's good for the feed. We are good to go. So that right there is our new setup. And hopefully that right there, you know, everything will miss the inner fender. Um, we can really, you know, twist this any way that we want to. I'm sure it'll just go back with the exhaust. And that's it. We're all V-banded and we got the wastegate ready to rock. Huge thanks to our buddy Taylor. He, uh, he always comes through when I need him. And uh, if you don't have a Taylor buddy, I recommend getting you one, because he is the man. So uh, we can continue now. I was a little bit nervous about that. I was a little nervous, but uh, you know what? I don't even know why I sweated it. Taylor's got it all under control, and we're ready to put it back on and uh, start trying to run some exhaust out of this thing. So uh, let's continue on. Super pumped.